Johnny's a good, good lad. Don't the ladies don't like him? No. That <laughs> old creature, they say, don't like him. Who are the women in the tapestry? Those are the ladies. Ladies lovely, with power over all, beseech I thee. Answer my call. Before you a worm crawls, wretched and small. Dare you disturb our rest, woman? Someone speaking through you? Good looking and clever, too. Where have you been hiding, boy? Mm, fuck you. I'm looking for the woman with ashen hair. I know you met her. Where is she? Oh, he's impatient. Perhaps he only likes ashen head girls. The young woman. She's my daughter by choice. I raised her. <laughs> if she's shapely, what does it matter? <laughs> Ooh, she's got an ear. Matters to me. I believe we fit them all. Bubbling like willow things. Oh, that's how I like some. It's clear you met her. Tell me everything. That was blunt. Well, perhaps it's for the best. Tell me, have you got bollocks? Do you fear woodland beasts? Oh, hard times are upon this white-haired one. Brother has turned against brother. The land is soaked in blood. Evil reigns stronger than ever before. A dark power has caused this near down one. Seek kingdom, hatred, and disdain. Destroy the beast, and we may be grateful. Tell you all we know about this ashen-haired news. Witch hunter, not a witcher. The alderman of Down Warren will tell you all. Remember to collect payment from him after you complete your task. And now our servant will bring you the dagger. Why do I need a dagger? A dagger? What for? When the alderman sees this dagger, he'll know we sent you. He'll leave it with us. I'll talk to the alderman, but I can't promise anything. Move, woman! Give the young man the dagger. And you, white one, return only once you've completed the task. Oh, mistress, right on me way. Dagger, gotta bring the dagger. The dagger for you. Lady told me to give it to you. Here it is. The dagger. Place the alderman's payment on the stone. Stone bear, stone shear. Okay, hold on a second.
Okay, so it looks like we can save the orphans or we can save the Baron. And whether or not we save the Baron, um, the, the men still go apeshit. So, I'm gonna be real, I would rather save the orphans. Um, Downworn will be destroyed. Downworn will be safe. If we kill the Whispering Hillock, the orphans are gonna die. Um, Baron and Anna will live, and Dorm Downward will be safe. So I want to. We're gonna save the orphans. We're gonna save the orphans. Uh, sorry, Baron, but you're, you know, you are an old guy. Sorry, Anna, but, you know, I, I guess it sucks to be Anna. Um, but I mean, I, I feel like Anna's situation is pretty fucked anyway. Like... I don't I don't feel like there's much coming back from this. <laughs> there's much coming back from this. Um and those, you know, the orphan like here's the thing. If we could find a way to save the orphans and to save Anna, I would do it. I would do it. But not worth. Not worth. You know, if we can't if we can't save the orphans then like fuck the grown. Cause that that's that's you know what the choice is. You have to choose whether you want to, you know, help the crones or whether you want to help the thing that they want you to kill. And so I I would rather help the thing that they want to kill, especially since the crones are just God. Disgusting. Especially since the crones are, you know, they're like they tried to kill Siri. You know? So I'm not gonna let them, you know, have some orphans to eat. Well, we're gonna make the choice that, you know, is the not putting orphans into the orphan mulching machine. You know? Okay, so we're gonna just head out if that away. A ruined tower, I wonder if it's here. Going to. Oh, I think I know what's here.
Like, I'm gonna be real. I know that the crones are, like, supposed to keep the town safe or whatever, but I feel like if the price of keeping the town safe is, like, you know, feeding orphans into the orphan grinding machine, you know, I don't think it's worth it. I don't think it's worth it. Right, right, that's that other kind of pet. Moon dust, vector oil. Well, I don't know. We have vector oil, but I don't think we have. We don't have moon. that lady
realize I'm about to die, and I didn't want to do all that shit all over again. Welcome to the stream. I just saw your message. Um, once again, don't know how long ago it was sent, but I just saw it now. So. Uh. What time is it? I'm gonna get hungry. For like dinner. <laughs> I went to the beach on, uh, when was it? Thursday, I think? Yeah, Thursday. And I got, uh, my eyes got sunburned. So that was fun. Did you know that your eyes can get sunburned? I didn't know until they did. Um, so yeah, I spent the past couple days, um, recovering from that because... It was awful and it hurt. There you go. I feel like we're getting a little bit better. Not quite as much keyboard smashing anymore. No. I mean, sometimes, sometimes we smash. Uh, yeah, it's very painful and it's like itchy and you can't like see. Like, so you know, I I had to drive to the beach, right? And then I had to drive myself home, and I was just, like, sitting in my car, in the parking lot, like, I cannot see. It is too bright. I cannot open my eyes. What the heck am I supposed to do? So, I just, like, pulled into a shady spot and kind of, you know, sat there until I could, you know, see well enough to go home. Um, but yeah, it was pretty bad. And, um, I would not recommend always make sure to wear your sunglasses when you are, uh, you know, at the beach. Greetings. I, like, I swear I only took them off for, like, ten minutes. But, you know, when you're out on the water and the sun is, like, reflecting off of the water into your eyes, like, it's not great. Nice village. Oh, I, a real pearl of the swamps. Apparently they have this thing called snow blindness, right. blindness oh, where you can't there. see because, you know, the light reflects off the snow in your eyes. Recognize this so yeah, I, I feel like it's, like, I, I couldn't, it's it's not that I couldn't see, it's that I couldn't keep my eyes open because it hurt. Um, it was weird. Uh, I don't belong to anyone. Don't belong to anyone. Down to business. I want to get this done quickly. Yeah, uh, so it was a very rare <laughs> sunny day. Usually it's a little bit cloudy, but what it, is. it was just it was beautiful though. The war awoke an ancient power. So yeah, I just Even I spent feeds on bloodshed, you know what was it yesterday? Nights and days hiding under an umbrella on the road, porch. Never to return. My dark sunglasses on. Under the tree on the whispering hillock they lie, unburied. All fathers, sons, daughters, and mothers. Folk are afeard to move them. You must go there. The dark powers. God, must yesterday be I even had trouble like watching TV. The, t the freaking TV was just like too bright. I'm like, no, I can't handle this. Uh... Need more details. You must see for yourself. Me grand's mum whacked me crosswise for straying near the whispering hillock. But what happens there now is a wonder. A few times, folk from round here gathered to chop down the trees. And burn the cursed soil back to use. None returned. The ground neath the weeds is white with human bones. How long has it been like that? When did all this start? Three years back. I remember, it was a warm day. Went to check the snares for game. Pulled the hair from me trap. It grew dark all of a sudden, though it was nigh on noontime. 
Thought it was a storm at first. A squeal pierced the air, near burst me ears. The hair rotted in me hands, and the leaves shriveled and yellowed, though it were yet the start of summer. Times have been ill ever since. Mm -hmm. Folks' teeth turn black as charcoal. Women Ew. folk fight like polecats, bawling and brawling over nothing. Mm. The young'uns, born crippled, lame, fear and cursing. Long have we pled for the ladies' help. Uh huh. I'll look around. <laughs> ladies of the wood don't know what this power is. They know all. Old Thecla claimed they'd be punishing us. Folks stop respecting them. Some even call them witches. Mm -hmm. But must not be they, for they sent you. I'll look around the whispering hillock. You be careful, Master Richard. Don't you treat this evil light. The thing is, these crones are like all powerful and all, right? But then they can't even handle like an, an ancient spirit thing. Like, come on, you, you can't handle an ancient spirit? Just like, you know, I feel like you should be able to handle an ancient spirit if you're a crone. Oh, what was on his head? Oh, it was the net behind him. Um, that's cool. What do you have for sale? Show me what you sell. Looks like I've been here because I it appears that I've played cards with her already, but, um... Get rid of other. Uh, oh, I forgot to put that. Out. I keep um, I keep dying. Is I'm not buy this gem. Well, I don't know what to tell you, man. Buy one of these. One of those. One of those. I don't know. Build inventory. Sell those. Buy one of those. Uh, I don't know that we'll have any use for them quite so soon, but eventually we will. So as the alchemy concoctions get more complicated, we have so many mushrooms from that trip into the cave. Um, I think I might need a moment. Uh, here, I'll just mute for a bit. And if I, if, if the screen stops moving, it's because I'm taking a brief moment.
Okay, I'm back. Um, I had milk in my coffee instead of creamer, and the creamer is like no lactose product at all or something like that, and the milk is just like lactose-free milk, and I think something that they leave in the lactose-free milk that's still like doing a little bit of witchcraft there. Anyway, I think there's something that they leave in the lactose-free milk that just, like, upsets my stomach sometimes. And so... Um... Where are we going? Back the way we came. Um... Let's... Let's look at our quest. Yeah, I think I'm gonna be good now. I know it's I think I'm gonna be good now, but I may need another little. I feel like I can fast travel a little bit closer. Alright, there's so many ruined towers. In Go like, you know, ten feet down the road and there's a new old two. Oh wait, hold Not, not, nope, not. It's funny how he's all serious, like, when the villagers have, like, dead bodies, he's like, you have to bury the dead bodies, and then when you kill somebody, or something, like, yeah, whatever. I know when she arrives. The powers that protect me. They sense whence you come. Okay. I think it's just inevitable that when there's a pack of wolves and they're attacking you, you're gonna get bit. I think I think that's an inevitability. You have to kind of accept. Even the women weren't spared. Like, one little wolf on its own is not too bad. A voice from within the tree. It wants to go down.
That would be uh beast or curse, curse, of curse. Curse oil. Mm. Shit! Oh, that was bad! Okay. Oh, how far back is that gonna set us? <laughs> Be gone. Come no closer. Well, that's not too bad. Do you though? Do you really know whence I come? Petri's filter increases sign intensity. Stamina and regeneration. I think we want to do stamina regeneration. Seem to do anything. Inventory beast here. This is first ones, right? A werewolf. They don't like fire. Okay, moon dust. And a devil's puffball inventory. I think we have a we have that one. Um. So we just have to like get him good. How do you like that silver? Let's get some first oil. Hey, coming? He's not coming. There we go. We just weren't hitting him. That's the problem. Uh, what are you doing? Show yourself. Do it. Typically, 
stamina regeneration during a clear movement. Oh my goodness, that was a hiccup. What a talk. Anything. We don't have anything, so we're gonna have to get a new thing. Uh, fast attack increased by 10%. I do fast attack a lot. I think fast attack. Yeah. yeah. And then we'll put a red one in there. Okay. Okay. The powers that protect me. They sense whence you come. We have cat. Why are we doing this? And we have cat. are we? Got a man there. Didn't see what it said though. Round in a circle. Come on, go a little bit fast. Uh, oh, and like through this. Hole. Dive. Dive. Right in. Let's go back home. Oh, that was the wrong one. I want to put life into double. Why have you come? Why still this blood? Um, Are you here to grant me death? Or is my freedom your wish? So we're actually gonna, um, I was attacked. I we're was gonna dead. free her. This is my prison. A fortress because that's the only way to save the orphans, and I want to save the orphans more than I want to save anybody else. Murderers. You know what the crowns? You must know the crowns pretty well. They are felons' curse. The year old through severed ears. They weave hair and twist lines. They take their strength from a broth of human flesh. Ew. Why did they kill you? Why did they kill you? The crowns want this land. They drew the wood alone. Oh, um, I'm getting a call, so I'm gonna do 
mute for a moment. Be right back. Something threatens the orphans. I'll help them myself. The children have been taken. Freely, please. I can be a girl. A gallop unchained. I shall save them. Only I can. Why do you think the kids from the meadow are in danger? The sisters took them. They shall not return. Where'd they take them? Save the orphans from the meadow. I'll help you. I will find them. Free. Okay, I'm back. Open the door of my cage. Blood is my escape. A right you must perform. With the black of raven feathers, the white of my bones, and the swift steed. Mm -hmm. Why do we need a black horse? The beast and I shall be as one. As when I lived, we shall be a gale. Nothing to stop us. Okay. A wild steed from meadows moist. Ain't. Back soon. I'll gather what I need to free you, then return. Gather and return to the Hillamix depths. <laughs> Me too. Um, I I really like, like especially the the whole like Crone's quest line and the Godling. It's really fun. She's opening a shortcut. Ooh, hush. Okay. Where are we going? We're going. Okay, so we that's uh, down Warren's. Oh, down Warren is the town. Oh, so I guess we're destroying the town too. You know what? Orphans. I care about the orphans. We are here for the orphans. People can pick up and move. A town is just a place. Orphans are people. <laughs> 